the Minecraft channel. Today I have a post review of Timney Art's diamond painting. Um, it's a 40 times 50 centimeters diamond painting and it's the fastest one that I've ever done. Um, I think I have worked on it to all in all around 10 hours at the most and yeah it was so nice to work on that it just went really fast to do it and to work on it. Um, I did use a multiplacer um, and uh, it's my favorite multiplacer that I've got here if you can see it up here somewhere. I need to get used to my new <laughs> new uh, camera. Um, I don't know but this uh, multiplacer it's uh, opaque one. You know you have the ordinary ones like these. Uh, they don't work as good for me as this one which I've only found two of. If you have seen these somewhere um, they are white and they're pretty thin uh, compared to, let's see if it's going to focus, yeah here you can see this is how they look, they're really plastic like and if you take the other one, if I can find it again, let's see, here, I don't know if you can see it, let's see if it's going to focus, please focus, focus, focus. Why it's always such a bother to, here, oh, no, 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 won't focus. But anyway, it's a bit more thick um, compared to the other one. Let's see if I can just take them up together. Hopefully you're not going to be too seasick. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it, but it's a bit more thick, the clear one, than the opaque one. And to me, um, it just works a lot more a lot better than uh, than uh, the uh, clear one but if you see <laughs> them sold anywhere in a diamond painting or just loose let me know because i'm on the hunt for more of them they are superb but let's <laughs> get into what it's about um as you can see uh this is the diamond painting and i if I have to compare this diamond painting to some of the other ones that I've done, it's above ever moment and I'm probably going to be killed now. Oh, you're not going to like it, but I think this one works better than ever moment. Um, it's, and perhaps I've just been really, really lucky with the, uh, the beats and so on, but they are perfect. I had no issues and I mean it, I found, I think in the three tens I found two or three weird beats, otherwise they were perfect, there were n not much residue or anything in it, but we can take a look at that ever, um, after uh, we've seen the painting. I think one of the reasons why it went so fast is <laughs> that I tried to follow this one over here, the chart. And as you can see, uh, they are not in order. So you got the three tens and then you got the 33rd, 31st, 71 and 938 and so on. And if you started in this corner, right corner low, you would be able to follow these symbols. So in this area down here you had the corresponding symbols all the way. So I didn't um, I didn't start uh, with uh, doing inventory and trying to sort out why and how they didn't match the DMC numbers. I tried to just say, where do I have the most free tens? And you could either have started in the uh, at the top, or you could have started at the 
at the bottom. But I could see if I was to start at the top, I would have to start from with uh, with the 414. So I thought, let's try and start from below and see what happens. And yeah, um, it was really nice to work that way. So I, I just used uh, the backs. First, I took the three, three tens out. Then I, I, uh, I used them up to almost the middle and I, I put them in a container and then I work with the next number, use them almost up to the middle and so on. And at the same time, I, I, I set up my diamond painting, but worked on it at the same time. So it was really nice and I think it saved a lot of time. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm definitely going to, now I've got some of the other ones which are not in order again. I am definitely going to check that because I think that they are pretty much smarter than we thought they were and that they are that there are reason why this uh, DMC colors are so mumbled jumbled together. It's because if you start the right way, these are the numbers that you're going to use. So first you use three times, then you use the number, next one, next one and next one. So but Let's see if the same thing, but at, with this painting, it really worked. So that was the first thing I wanted to say. Uh, second, uh, as I said before, quality of beads. I really, really like them. As you can see, they're nice and sparkly. Let's go close in. They are, as you can see, really uniform. So it went really fast and I haven't rolled it yet. I need to roll it and then I'm going to definitely hang it. It's so nice. So let's go a bit back so you can see it in from a bit further. And this is how it looks. I think the moon is a rather, it's not completely round, but that's down to the size, I think. If you wanted to have more detail and a more round moon and so on, you needed to have gone up uh, a size or two. But uh, yeah, to me, it doesn't really matter. I really like, first I didn't like the gray uh, shadow around the the cat's uh, ears and so on, but I, I think it's uh, it's going to, or it, it, it's, it's supposed to look like he's, uh, he's, uh, this moonshine is hitting his ears and so on so it's really really good yeah and i think it's a him <laughs> um so yeah um that's the painting really satisfied really liking it i think my son wants it in his uh his room uh, together with his Star Wars one, I don't know how it's going to match up, but Master Yoda and his cat, perhaps. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, let's um, let's just take a look at all the drills. Um, sorry for being messy. So they're here, and perhaps I should just find a tripod to stand you on so you don't have to be moved around all the time. Hang on. Hi again. Oh, yeah, you've just been put down on a <laughs> on a smaller tripod. So, so here's my colors and you, as you can see 20 of them and there's some in the back. Um these three four colors that's in here are the smallest amount together with i think there's yeah some more but these are the smallest amounts uh, that i had left um but loads of amounts uh, loads left anyway i still need to have them and here we have all uh, the other colors these were the larger amounts and this is the three tons I hope you're able to see it, but this is how it looked. As you can see, they're real uniform, these three tents. Definitely ones that I'm going to save. Uh, not much garbage in them. So yeah, pretty good. Um, 
I had lots of drills left in most of them. So uh, I, I didn't have a fear of running out. This is uh, another lat color, uh, the 3371. Um, and then I have, again down here, another large color. Um, so yeah, um, all the way it didn't run out. This one, I even have a full bag left off. Um, so yeah, they, I was really, really, definitely a store that I recommend definitely a store that I'm going to buy off again um, so good uh, I don't know um, if we just take it over here I don't know for me this part the fluffy velvety part I don't know if it's going to make a difference when you um, like put them into a uh, canvas or into a frame or something uh, for me I don't know if it's going to do anything uh, besides sorry I'm almost hitting you, <laughs> uh, hitting you. Uh, but I don't know if it's going to do anything but what I really like is that the glue on it was really good um, and and yeah uh, so so when you stuck the drills down you didn't have anything popping back up um, I still want to roll it because I can feel that some of them are not completely down but that's due to my own my own mistakes so uh, they need to be popped down so yeah uh, and what have I else been doing I have been diamond painting because I finished this way too early and as we're going on a trip uh, tomorrow I didn't want to start up anything uh, so I did this one instead which I always also really really like uh, I don't hope that my my camera is going completely nuts I don't think so um, lots of clear shine and bling and so on and again I substituted my Aurora Borealis here we can just take the colors from it it's here again lots of colors left I didn't I wasn't afraid of uh, running out of anything here they're really really nice lots of things left lots of drills left all the colors here i think this is the least amount left of the bling bling colors and here again um i did substitute this was the one 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 that's belonging to the other paint i substituted these two this aurora borealis and this one with ordinary green I took a green color it's not close to the other one but I I thought it looked really good on the background as you can see it's here and here and if you take it up I thought it looked really good so I, f I chose that one and I chose ordinary white you can see down here an ordinary white one instead of this one and again I am really satisfied I'm um, they are a bit weird uh, I'm also working on um, on the winter one at the moment I've got all four of them and I'm going to do all four of them um, and they are a bit weird in their size because they're 24 centimeters if you measure them um, from from side to side of the painting they are 24 precisely and I was in looking if I could find a, 
a frame which is 24 and I can't but I found one which is 23 and that's from Ikea uh, I think it's called Riba uh, or something but anyway um, I'm going up there uh, and I'm going to buy some of those I think I'm going to buy all four of them the other one is here uh, again really really nice nice to work on and again I'm going to substitute the bling bling one uh, and this one Aurora Borealis with an ordinary white one just to tone it down um, I think it works really good with ordinary drills combined with the rhinestones ones it takes a bit of the yeah a bit of the bling bling out of it <laughs> and I really like this one so I hope this is going to turn out as good they don't take long to do I think around um, around one to two hours to do each so it's not uh, it's not uh, a huge project so they're nice to do in the evening and so on when you don't have so much time and I think it's going to turn out really brilliant so yeah that's my plan uh, so I'm going to do or be radio silent for the next couple of days because we are going my daughter and I as I've said before are going um, on a trip together and we'll be back on Tuesday evening I think so it's a short one um, and uh, on Thursday we're then going uh, on winter holiday to Copenhagen so I'm going to not be as active in the next week or so but you take care and I hope you liked the video if you haven't subscribed please please subscribe need some more subscribers so we can hit the 500 and we can do a giveaway because that's what must be next to do a giveaway right and yeah uh i had some other thing i have another thing that i would ask you and i'm going over here i was wondering which one of these you want to see next because i wanted to do one of those so there's the bear one and there's the sorry we've got so many things stashed in here Ugh, my old tripod and so on. so we got that one and we've got that one and we've got the girl which is upside down so here she is <laughs> which one of those did you want to see me do next i would love to do one of those so that's the bear the sunflowers or the girl please let me know if you've got anything that you would like to see and yeah i hope you are going to have a really good day and do some diamond painting and other crafting i will see you soon in my next video comment below if you've got any comments uh questions and so on uh yeah and uh yeah See, I talk to you soon. Take care. Bye for now.